Right, those are the bending arms made up. Only tack welded together at the moment. So that'll fit in there. And it'll pivot up like that. This steel plate will get welded onto the back of there. And the top edge of the steel plate will do the bending. So I need to get these fully welded now. I just hope the welding hasn't closed the hole up in the housing any. It shouldn't have done. I've made the housing big enough to pray, uh, try and prevent that. And then this steel plate that gets welded on the back of this box section. But before I do that I've got to get the bending arms lined up in the pivot pins, so I'll let it all cool down first. Right, that's the bushes in. I've got the bending arms bolted into place. And I've got this steel plate welded to the box section. So it's the top edge of this steel plate that does the bending. 
that'll be okay for bending thinner materials but for heavier gauge uh, steel um, I'll probably need to increase uh, the width of this top edge so I've got some 12 mil plate which I can bolt to the front of this plate and that will increase the top edge thickness to 20 mil so um, next thing to do now is to get these um, backstops made up need to put a piece of 50 mil angle line along the back here right, I've got the holes drilled to the angle line for the backstops got the backstops screwed in here just needs a couple of nuts on there So that keeps the top jaw lined up. Right, something else I'm going to need to stop this lifting up when I'm bending a piece of metal. I'm going to need to clamp this down onto the bench. So I'll cut two pieces of angle iron and bolt them on the end here. One on each side. Right, I've got the two clamping brackets made to clamp it down onto the onto the bench, one on each side. I've also got this 12 mil thick plate made, which is going to bolt on the um, on the bending arm there. So that just sits on top of the box section and gets bolted through with two bolts and the top edge is flush with the other plate. So that just needs bolting on. Right, found the spring in my box of springs. Welded a peg on the top jaw. Made a little fitting 
So I'll come the other end, drill the hole through, through there. 